After escaping from their subterranean dungeon and crossing the pit of the fires of Tor, Tarzan and his companions rescue Darno and Uka from two palace guards who are about to throw them into the fiery chasm. Leaving the guards bound and gagged, the fugitives follow the corridor to its end, where they are stopped by a massive metal-studded door. Meanwhile, in Atea's chamber, the queen and Wong Tai discuss the death to be meted out to Tarzan. In the midst of the discussion, Mungo arrives with the two guards who had been overpowered by the ape-man. Furious because her plans have been again upset by Tarzan, Atea orders a thorough search of the subterranean passageways. In the underground corridor, Uka opens the huge door by pressing one of its metal studs. The fugitives discover themselves in a great chamber filled with medieval implements of war. They also find their own arms and ammunition. During their examination of the ancient arsenal, they are surprised by the arrival of Atea, Wong, Mungo, and a strong guard of yellow men. Toner Tarzan, there are too many for us. This is going to take one or more of us off the deep end, my friends. Oh, if we'd only thought to close that door. Yes, Bigari, that was a mistake, leaving it open. They never would have looked in here for us if the door had been shut. What's your plan of battle, Tarzan? It'll be only a matter of moments before they find us. Ah, there's only one plan of battle for us, Major. Fight for the last man. What do you say, Tarzan? Mais, Mademoiselle Jeannette. What is to become of her when we are... Oh, don't let me stand in the way of a finished fight, Tarzan. Good girl, Jeanette. Then we'll do the best we can. If I could only line me sights on that slant-eyed Wong Tai. Ah, but he's in a terrorist staying out there in the corridor. Oh, Happy Gary, the goats out of the stable. They've seen us, and here they come. If we could get our backs to the wall, oh, it is too late. They are swarming around us like bees. They've got you, Ned. Coming, old girl. Ashley, behind you. Look out. Blue polo on the look for Look down. Écoute. Écoute. Do not run out there. Oh, mort diable. He is the madman. Oh, Bigari Tarzan. The lieutenant and Uka are down. And the major. Come on, O'Rourke. Oh, that, that leaves the two of us. Oh, back to back, my lad. They'll know they've been through a plague before we go down. Oh, oh Bigari Tarzan, the Major. Oh, that spear went train through. Oh, Tarzan and the red-haired one. Unless they throw down their arms, strike the woman where she stands. Oh, 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 oh. Surrender or Jared die. Oh, come to me, ye slant-eyed head, and I'm I'm taking you with me. Tarzan, you hear? Give in before too late. The devil. There goes the last of my cartridges. Oh, well, a rifle makes a fine two-handed shillelagh. Strike down the woman, Mungo. Tarzan, O'Rourke, stop. There are too many. More guards are coming. Throw oh, away that rifle, O'Rourke. If we don't stop, they'll kill Jeanette. Well, Tarzan, my lad, I don't like to admit it, but we're licked. Uh, faith, man, you're, you're bleeding like a stuck pig. Uh, it's nothing. A scratch. All right, Mungo. Oh, uh, then. Uh, you come now. Well, uh, out there in corridor. You are a mighty warrior, Tarzan of the Apes. You and these others. But a moment more and you would all have been dead. Your men, Ate, are not good fighters. Tarzan, right? do not antagonize our Monavi. She is a devil. Why does Jeanette cry, Arno? Is she hurt? No. It is Monsieur Major. 
He is very badly hurt. A spear thrust. Is he? Will he die, Terry? How is it, O'Rourke? Let me see. Oh, spear through the lungs. Yes, it is bad. You're, you're wounded, Tarzan. Your chest. Oh, nothing, Anthony. A little scratch. Oh, Uncle Jim. Uncle Jim. It's, it's all right, Janet. Heads up, old girl. It's, it's the fortunes of warriors. Tarzan, I must speak with Major Ashley before he goes on. I think what I have to say will make his passing less difficult. Ah, uh, Lei Bei Wang, you've caused enough trouble with your double dealing. What I have to say to the Major concerns only himself and me, O'Rock. Please, stand between us and Atea, all of you. I do not wish her to see. Oh. Is, is that you, Wang? Yes, Major. O'Rock, Tazan, you are that. Stand back a little. Oh, so. Ashley, my friend, listen. You must not condemn my action without a hearing. Or Jerry. On the face of Lieutenant. The... Can't something be done for him? We have done all that is possible to do, Mademoiselle Jeanette. It is as he said, the fortune of war. Uh, you must be brave. Ah, uh, just that, darling. Your Uncle Jim said, heads up. He must do as he says. <laughs> but that is all I have. Ah, leave be, Alana. You have Terry O'Rourke to look after you now. Yes. Yes, I... I'm all right now. Voyez, mademoiselle. Your uncle. He smiled. That's something Monsieur Le Wong Tai has said to him. And their hands, they clasp in friendship. Uh, come, Janet. He has a word for you and for O'Rourke. Yes, Uncle Jim. I, I'm here. Hold me up a little higher, Terry. So. So you're taking my place with Jeanette, my boy. Be good to her. Ah, that goes without saying, Major Ashley. Good. Jeanette, old girl. Don't grieve. Remember. You're a... You're a burden. They were all fighters. Oh. <laughs> He's gone, Terry. Come, Makushla. The old one, he's dead, Tarzan. Yes. And I claim the right to avenge his death in personal combat with the man who killed him. You told us that is the law of Tor. The right is yours, Tarzan of the Apes. Providing you can point out the one who struck the fatal blow. It was Mungo. My chief of warriors. Mungo, you hear? Was it by your hand that this man perished? Ah, look up there. I kill him. You have heard Tarzan of the Apes claim the ancient right of Tor against you? I fight him. I kill him too. <laughs> Mungo is the mightiest of all Torian warriors. Tarzan of the Apes. You have sealed your own death warrant. I am ready. It shall be arranged. And that all Tor may witness the combat, it will take place in the public arena. It will be a day of feasting and celebration. And the remains of my... of Major Ashley? He shall be given burial fitting to a brave warrior and a noble of Tor. The ceremonial rites of Pantu shall be performed in his honor. Jeanette Burton and my friends... What of them? You shall all be... One moment, heaven-born. Think well, O oh daughter of Tor, of my counsel in regard to arousing the hatred of this man. Hmm. Yes, perhaps you are right. Until the day of your combat with Mungo Tarzan, you men are condemned to labor in the elephant paddocks. And Jeanette? She will remain here in the palace with me. She will be safe? <laughs> She will live to see you perish by the hand of the mighty Mungo. We shall see. The heaven-born daughter of Thor is a clever woman. We will see, Wong Tai, if your counsel is wise. Mungo, take these men to the paddock. Place them in the care of Rutang, chief of the elephant men. Go! Trust Tarzan, Mademoiselle Jeanette. We have been in much more dangerous places before. Somehow he will get us out of this. Oh, my. 
I hope so. And remember, Kushla, heads up. Yes, Terry. All of them, wild men. Come along, Mungo, no. We're ready. Wong Tai, bring Janet Burton. I obey, Celestial One. Come, Janet. Oh, Dr. Wong, why did you turn against us? Lower your voice, my child. Are you convinced that I did turn against you? Oh, well, isn't it rather apparent? You have your freedom. You shot Terry down there in the dungeon. Atea seems to trust you. I flatter myself, perhaps, in the belief that she has a certain amount of confidence in me. And it is well for you, for us all, that she has. Well, then, then why couldn't you have kept him from killing Uncle Jim? Hmm. Kung Fu Tse once said, That which God writes on thy forehead, thou wilt come to it. It was his destiny, my child, to die here, fighting in your defense. And, and Terry, the lieutenant, all of us, are we to die here too? The answer rests in the lap of the gods. Do you know what Atea intends doing with us? The all-conquering determination to appear well in the eyes of Tarzan, to win his love in a not clearly defined manner, is the cause of her indecision as to what to do with you. Oh, she'll kill us all. Perhaps. To counteract her plans will not be easy. But it should not be beyond our united power, backed by a reasonable amount of activity on the part of our protecting ancestor. Continue to act as though I were your enemy and try not to antagonize Athea. But where are we going? To her quarters. She will probably keep you close to her person to watch you. Oh, I... I'm frightened, Dr. Wong. Do not allow your fear to become apparent. If you do, you are lost. Silence now. We arrive at Athea's quarter. <laughs> <laughs> 